Mitchell, they are one of the most popular acts in Vegas, wowing audiences on the Strip, and most recently at Red Rock Resort. But now comes word that Zoe Boy may be breaking up. Here to set the record straight is Chris Phillips, of course, the male half of the band that we've become know and love. <laughs> this all started with a tweet over the weekend uh, with Marley yes. saying that uh, she's been resigning from Zoe Boy and she wishes that, you know a lot of love to the fans. And you're saying this is kind of a surprise, right? Uh, to some degree. We knew that Marley was uh, anxious to pursue her own career doing her own original music, which I'm very proud of her for doing. She's wanted to do this for years. And so I think the timing was right for her to kind of branch off and do that at this point. And uh, as a lot of people don't know, uh, I, I have been Zoe Bowie years prior to her coming aboard. And so I think at this point, now that she's decided to go her own direction, we're going to certainly keep the party going. Uh, and, you know, since we've been back at Red Rock, we are so proud to say that the locals didn't forget us, and Good. it's been just absolutely insane out there. Uh, we've been bringing in five to seven hundred locals uh, every Friday night. Fantastic. We've been turning people away at the door, and we just want to let people know that uh, we're going to continue this on. Of course, I'm going to still stay as absolutely as immature and uh, <laughs> as, as I've always been. I think she may have wanted to mature herself, and so I don't She's blame like, I'm her. Growing up and, you know, no, but it's it's really exciting yeah. for me because I I kind of have the enthusiasm of like a teenager with a garage band that's playing its first gig because. I've been standing next to a significant other doing this for 15 yes. years. And so uh, what we're going to do and what I'm really excited about is the fact that uh, since it will just be me, I know for sure that I wouldn't want to watch me for two hours either. <laughs> so we're going to bring in uh, featured uh, female celebrity, uh, celebrity singing guests. Uh, as an example, this Friday we have Lorena Peril, mm -hmm. the new uh, star of the fantasy show at Luxor. She's amazing. Great dynamic She's been performer. here on the show with the Sin City Girls she was she's, performing with for a while. She's amazing. And yes. then uh, I'm very proud to say that a very dear friend of mine is going to be joining us next Friday, the 15th, Angelica Bridges. Oh, we love Angelica. She's been here, too. And she and her band, Strawberry Blonde, may even come on and do a little something with us, which uh, I'm extremely excited to see because, you okay. know, not only is she gorgeous, but she's extremely talented. And so, uh, you know, I'm... I'm so Zoe Boy continues just not in the way, I mean, because obviously fans have come to love, you know, you and Marley so much, and it's, it has to be difficult because you guys were engaged and personally yes. connected for so long, and that relationship ended a little, a little it was, ago. It was a year ago this week. Oh, really? Not <laughs> So on our, Do you want to show her to cry? You can. You're right. So on our anniversary of parting personally, we've now parted professionally as uh -huh. well, and so that's great. The, the band and our, our 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 fans and everything know that uh, you know I'm really the one who has kind of been the spearhead of what Zoe Bowie is from the get go, and and I have no intention, like I say, of of. Uh, be, being anything but a juvenile delinquent who drinks too much. And <laughs> but she, on her own, is going to stay here in Las Vegas. She is. I hope so. We can still see Marley around town as well. Too, Absolutely. Uh, actually, you can see her on Wednesday nights at the Tropicana doing her thing, I believe, uh, uh, in the lounge. Okay. Uh, so both wishing each other well. Oh, everything. my gosh. Just, just a, I'll be in the just crowd. Just a change. Sure. Good. Absolutely. Good. Absolutely. And you guys have both done so much for local charities, not just entertaining us. So yes, and we're excited. It's going to be a different change, though, for fans. I, I'm very excited to announce, too, for Opportunity Village coming up with their Magical Forest yes. uh, that they have coming. We're going to be doing a 18 piece vintage Vegas uh, holiday show oh, for them that. out at the Magical Forest. I believe, I'm not sure exactly, but uh, I think it's going to be on Wednesday, the 15th of December. And, uh, so, my passion really is to keep the essence of what the Maverick spirit of Vegas yeah. was all about from the beginning, which is the old standards and the, as they were just talking about the Sinatra days sure. and uh, the, the, that whole era, I think was really a magical so even time. This weekend, you're still on a Red Rock. Friday night, we'll okay. be there at 11 o'clock and, uh, as usual, drinking too much and getting in some trouble. <laughs> so still, you know, without Marley, without how we're used to seeing Zoe Bowie, but she's going to stay here performing, you're doing your thing, and yes. you guys will both play. hey, two more acts to go see then, right? That's right. <laughs> more, more entertainment, you're spreading the wealth, but, you know, we wish her the best. She's nothing but a class act as well. So, oh, we love her Chris, uh, congratulations. We're so glad that the actual fun. Zoe Bowie isn't breaking up, even though it's changing, it's, it's evolving, right? right? We're evolving and expanding. Okay. All right. Well, and we love to have Mar Marley come on the show, too, so we'll find out what she's doing on the Tropicana. So, all right. Good luck to you, Chris. Thank you so change. much for having me on. Yes, thank you for saying rumors straight. Well, I know. <laughs> Over to you, Sean.